multiplicative property of equality with sine fractions. We're asked to solve for v, and on the left-hand side with the v, there is this negative six-fifths coefficient. And I would like to get rid of that negative six-fifths so that I would have the v by itself. So to get rid of the negative six-fifths coefficient, I'm going to multiply by the reciprocal, negative five-sixths. Now I can do that by the multiplicative property as long as I also multiply the other side by negative five-sixths. So whatever I multiply on one side, I have to multiply on the left on the other side as well. So the fives will now cancel on the left hand side. The sixes will also cancel. That's why I use the reciprocal. But the reciprocal also happens to be the same sign. So a negative times a negative will also cancel and become a positive, leaving me with just the V on the left hand side of our equation. And then on the right hand side, uh, I've got some stuff that's going to cancel here. So 6 goes into 30 five times. So on the top, I've got 5 times negative 5. That's negative 25 over what is now 1, 1 times 1. So V equals negative 25.